Here's an Excel technique for retaining the original sort order in your data. So let's say I have some data here and I want to sort it, maybe I want to sort it by date, but I know that I also want to revert back to the original sort order because that's important to us. So before we do any sorting here, we're going to add an index column. And we're going to go to the right of the table here. I'm just going to type a one in this cell and two in the next cell. And I'll select both of those and double click the fill handle. And that's going to create this list of sequential numbers here. And these are hard-coded values. You can call it whatever you want, but I'm going to call it an index column. So now that I have my index column, I can go sort the other column. So again, maybe I want to sort by date here. Maybe I want to sort by the item and I can continue to sort across columns. And when I want to revert back to the original sort order, I just need to then sort the index column. So I'll just sort it smallest to largest. That'll sort it from one all the way down to last row here. And I now have my original sort order restored. The practice file to this data is available in the description. You can use it from there. Like and follow for daily tips.